with them in the same. Man in the big green hat. I'm here at the Morgan Prairie Overlook at Knoxby National Wildlife Refuge. Perfect spot to do a short hike, about four tenths of a mile, and see a variety of wildflowers and a great overlook of Lake Coma Lake. So let's go see what all little botanical wonders we can find today. So the video itself is not going to be very, very long in terms of if we walk in the trail part of this. You see it's kind of this open prairie. And they're way in the distance. There's the pavilion, that's the overlook. That's kind of the, the end point, it makes a loop. Back to the parking area. We'll walk up, look at this kiosk here. Lots of little wildflowers right here at the stop. start. This is heel all. And some cone flowers. And daisy flea vein. Yeah, this looks like it would have been some kind of lion's mane type thing. It's past bloom now. The purpose of the Morgan Hill Prairie Demonstration Area, as yes, we're calling it now, it seems, is kind of uh, to put back in place the Black Belt Prairie that extended across a large part of the southeast in a band. There's not a whole lot of it left, and a huge focus on uh, prairie type plants that enjoy the soil and the butterflies and the birds that it attracts. Here's Queen Anne's lace. Lots of bit around. And some sneeze weed. And this I've always called wild atuatum. It has another name for it but I've forgotten. Still just tons and tons of cone flowers. A little purple flower here that I don't know the name of. Next to tons of daisy flea bane and, and cone flower. There's also several different types of milkweed that's now going to seed. Oh, and here's a little bit of lobelia. That's cool. A little blackbird that flew across. And that in the distance is Loke Foma Lake. Pretty sure this is vetch. And then this taller here, I believe it's a type of milkweed, but I don't know what kind it is. I could be completely mistaken. I'm not familiar with this. Lots of it growing in this little area. Just before the boy walked the overlook. This section is completely regrowing with what looks like pear trees almost and sumac and oaks. We 
very little wildflowers on the northern part of this hike so far. They've added an extension to the trail here, but we didn't hike that. Some beautiful beard's tongue, pinstemon. I could be mistaken. About three feet tall. It's gorgeous. This is skull caps and a spurge of some kind. Now we're coming to the end of the little short walk. I'm working prairie at Knoxville National Wildlife Refuge. Hope you enjoyed all the little wildflowers we've seen today. Until next time, keep exploring folks and stay wild.